I'm just going to vlog this right now, yeah, no matter what the outcome is, because right now, it's been a very stressful day, okay, long story short, two weeks ago, I bought Chris Brown tickets, I bought Chris Brown tickets for today in Birmingham, Sunday the 19th of February, you get me, cool, I bought, I say Chris Brown tickets, I bought one for myself, one for myself, yeah, today, I had a couple of people that were looking for Chris Brown tickets, so I was going to buy tickets and resell them to people, you get me, so, I was looking on Twitter, I got scammed £90, someone told me they gave me two tickets for £90, I got scammed by them, cool. Then I got scammed another £200 for trying to buy four tickets for seating, the person told me £68 per, per seat, I think it was three seats actually, three seats. And right now I'm just so scared because I bought my Chris Brown ticket off a of reseller, so the ticket I've actually got, I don't even know if it's real, but I'm heading there right now, you know, and we're all going to find out together, man, like, this is one stressful ass vlog, and I love Chris Brown, so it's really getting to me, so... Just keep watching, man. Stay tuned. I'm here now, yeah. I don't shit in my soul car. I just compare my ticket to someone else's, yeah. And they don't look like the same ticket, guys, so... <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> Guys, I'm 300 pound down. I've got a ticket that might not be real. This might be my 13th reason. 13th? Uh, yeah, that was bro. Like 18th, bro. Yeah. <laughs> That's what? Three tickets. Three tickets, you know? Zero when you're hurting. Okay. Yeah. About four tickets and one unreliable one. We're gonna see, we're gonna see, we're gonna see, guys. Like I said, this vlog, yeah, is no matter the outcome. As I said, this vlog, yeah, was based on whatever the outcome would be. And as you can see, I'm at home, I'm at home, yeah. So I'll break it down to you. I went to. Resorts World Arena with Tiny Ty and 22. I think you seen 22 in my vlog. Tiny was at the back. I don't know why he went in the vlog. But yeah. We've got there. These two are shitting themselves, yeah. Thinking their ticket's fake, blah, blah, blah. Because they bought off resellers too. But they compared their ticket to mine. And their reseller bought their ticket from Ticketmaster. And mine apparently bought his ticket from Ticketmaster. And my barcode looked nothing like how theirs looks. My barcode looked like something from the shop, like the little lines and stuff. And their barcode was like one square with some lines in it and blah de blah and dots in it and all that stuff. So from there, I had a bad feeling. Anyway, guys, we come. If you guys send the line, if you guys send the line, we pushed in. We pushed in and we, we got to the front within about 10 minutes, yeah? We got to the front. Luckily, I did that because it... it as you can tell, I wasted my time. There's no Chris Brown footage. There's me at home. So, yeah, we've got there. And unfortunately, the guy's scanning my thing. He's scanning my barcode. It's not working. He's trying to type it in manually. It's not working. My ticket was fake, guys. I bought this ticket about three weeks ago. I bought this ticket about... Oh, I bought this ticket about three weeks ago, guys. Yeah. And what made it worse is I took a couple hours... Because as I, I don't know if I said it earlier, but I bought a ticket earlier, well, I bought three tickets earlier, standing tickets for my friend in it, for two hundred pounds, and the person scammed me and blocked me. So that's already twice now I've been scammed, yeah. And then I went to buy another two tickets to resell earlier, bought them for ninety, and that person scammed me as well. So I'm down a lot of money right now, guys. Like it's actually not even funny, but content is content. And I'm gonna talk about my hours and my wins. Like this is what it is now. You get me so like. I'm not really happy and the reason why I'm not happy is I'm a big grown man. I'm 22 turning 23, yeah? And I grew up listening to Chris Brown, like, I grew up so... It's always been on my bucket list to see him live. I seen him at Wireless. I said I wanted to see his actual concert. He's told he's came to Birmingham, my hometown. And I haven't got to see it because I've been scammed. People are evil, guys. Like, I'm actually... <laughs> laugh for your cry. Like... You man can raw come out as well be like, man's crying, my next man, bloody black. Bro, you see when it's Chris Brown, I don't care. You can't tell me now, bro. I'm upset. I'm upset. I'm heartbroken. I'm angry. Every negative emotion in the world right now is what I feel. But it is what it is, man. We're going to bounce back. We're going to bounce back. Like, yo. 
The only thing is, by the time Chris Brown comes back to the UK, if he ever does, he won't be able to hit all these dance moves and these front flips that he's doing now. So it won't be the same. I've missed out. I've took a fat out of you lot. But you know what? We live and we learn, man. We live and we learn. Next time, I just need to wake up early and get the actual ticket. So ticket master. <laughs> but yeah, man, guys, listen. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with some content soon in a bit, man.